Israel intensifies attacks in Gaza as conflict enters. Fifth day, Israel has intensified its assault on Gaza as Palestinian militants continued to fire rockets into Israel. On the fifth day of hostilities, Israel's military said air and ground forces were involved in attacks on Friday but had not entered Gaza. Meanwhile, clashes between Palestinians and the Israeli security forces spread across much of the occupied West Bank. Jewish and Israeli Arab mobs have also been fighting within Israel, prompting its president to warn of civil war defense minister. Benny Gantz ordered a massive reinforcement of security forces to suppress the internal unrest that has seen more than 400 people arrested. Police say Israeli Arabs have been responsible for most of the trouble and reject the accusation that they are standing by while gangs of Jewish youth target Arab homes. In Gaza, Palestinians, fearing an incursion by Israeli troops, have been fleeing in areas close to the border. With Israel residents who had left in Gaza City, said shells had been falling on homes in a statement released early on Friday morning, Israeli PM. Benjamin Netanyahu said the country's military operation against Palestinian militants would continue for as long as necessary. He added that Hamas would pay a heavy price. As what other terrorist groups, a Hamas military spokesman said, the group was ready to teach Israel's military harsh lessons. Should he decide to go ahead with a ground incursion? Also on Friday, there were protests at the Jordanian and Lebanese borders with Israel in support of the Palestinians.